Hey, good morning guys. It's 7.30 in the morning and I finally got the drone flying and I did the hover test last night. She worked. I'm super fucking excited. So I'm up bright and early before the sunrise to go uh, do the maiden flight out at the club in Elmira. Um, but first, I gotta get some coffee in me. Hi, this is Sean. How can I help you? Hi, can I get a medium double-double? Anything else? No, that's it. 185, make sure you're gonna see at the window. Thank you. You're welcome. Coffee time. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Coffee time. 185, please. Uh, it'll be debit. Credit. Great, and there you go. Thanks, have, have a good day. day. See if the Tim's is burnt or not. It's not bad. It's not bad. I can work with this. A little sweet. I haven't had Tim's in fucking forever. I tend to drink uh, Kahlua coffee that I make it myself. Yeah, I, I can't even begin to explain my excitement right now to try out this drone. It's been like, well, it was early November that I first bought the controller. And spent about a hundred hours in the simulator. Fucking video games, basically. But I'd like to think that that's got me ready to go. I've never actually flown a five inch drone in acro mode before so I'm pretty fucking scared I guess I just spent about seven hundred dollars buying all the parts and researching them and studying how to solder I've never soldered before in my life no shit all about electrical components and how any of that works the most electrical savvy thing I've ever done before is build a computer and comparatively that's like playing with fucking Lego snap the pieces in where they fit this this was like you get five six different circuit boards and a camera and a battery and a whole bunch of wires and you just have to like solder them together in a rat's nest of a maze of wires I don't know how I did it I watched all the other YouTubers talking about doing it and how they burnt and exploded like four or five quads before they even completed their first one that worked and... Did I do this wrong? No, I don't go this way. Let's go. Oh, fuck. Alright, well... What do you think is going to happen? Predictions? Holy fuck. It didn't blow up. And it talked to you. First try. And it talked to you. Fucking, what, three days of building later? Four days? Four days. <laughs> Complicated. Day. Yes! Somehow I got it on the first try. I don't know. I just got lucky, I guess. But cheers to that. Apparently there's a big uh, pile of snow in front of the club. That's kind of a bitch. Okay, a little bit of snow never stopped me from doing anything anyways. Okay, so basically with there being like three inches of snow everywhere 
and I didn't take the time to conformal coat my drone yet, which is like a, a waterproofing chemical you put on electronics so that they don't die when they touch water or snow. Because uh, I, I finished building it and I want to fly it and I didn't really want to take it all apart and spend another day not flying. So here we are, three inches of snow everywhere and yeah, if I crash, might be fucked, but I prepared and I, uh, I don't know if you can see, but I legit like just duct taped the shit out of the bottom of the drone and the motors so that if I crash, maybe I won't die. We'll see. I gotta stop looking at the screen, not the camera screen, camera screen, camera. Look at the camera, that's where you are. Okay, thanks. Good luck, Tom. You need it. Okay. I'm gonna do this. Okay. Well, time to go put her out. Put on the goggles. Fire her up. Fuck me. This is horrifying. Okay, throw it all down. Switches up, switches up, switches up. <clears throat> Learn it for shit before you do this. So you don't want to hurt yourself or anyone else. Okay. I'm gonna put her out and be right back. Let's go. Let's see if we have vision, first of all. That would be clutch. We're on. There's cam 7, so let's go to. Turn off the noisy ass fan. Okay. We have video feed. Okay, so I was using the wrong switch to arm. I don't even know my fucking arm switch, but yeah, here it goes. Let's do this. So recording, still recording. Okay, we're armed. Idle up. We have throttle. And then let's give it up. Oh my god, this is fucked. So we're up, we're up, we're up. Video is okay. Wow, yeah, that. That's fucked. This is a lot different than the simulator. Gerard said that it was a lot more floaty in real or in the sim. He wasn't lying. Okay, I'm gonna try and bring her in. Let's see if we can land her. Snow. She's down. Yes! Didn't fucking crash. Okay, Maiden, she seems to be working. I have pretty shit video range though. I think I need to increase the power or something. I'm not really sure. <sighs> That's fucking horrifying. So I increased the video power feed. We're gonna Try this again, a little bit more range. Start the recording. Okay, so throttle down, idle up position, arm, and give the throttle some power. Okay, here we go. Let's go up. God damn.
This is horrifying. Oh my god, there's trees, buildings. Man, she fucking zips. She looks high too. Need to watch my milliamp hour. Oh, what? Okay, let's go backwards. That VTX gets weak, that's horrifying. to say. <laughs> so this is fucking intense. Sort of zipping back and forth here. Okay, let's bring her in again. Oh, she's upside down. Let's go get her. Poor thing. I need to do a little bit of quick math. Heart is fucking racing. Calculator 3.8 times 6 equals 22.8. So 22.8 volts. I need to watch for. Make sure the throttle is down. Um, start recording again. Need that DVR. I said 22.8 volts, so we have a bit more voltage to go through. Let's turn that on. Yeah, in the middle, in the middle. Don't seem to have audio for some reason. That's okay, I'll figure that out. Another time. Tree. We don't want to hit the tree. Okay, we're getting close to 22.8, so let's bring it back. Do another landing if we can. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Beautiful landing. 22.9. Okay. That's pack one. Let's go for pack two. So, didn't really feel like I'm gonna puke, but you know, here's time for pack two. Sun's coming up now. DVR is recording. And, sit back and relax. Throttle down, armed. On. And let's punch it. Nope. And punch it. Man, she fucking gives. It's 
so funny hearing her fly by the car. Man, my coordination is fucked right now. Zoom. Try. I don't know. Try and split us this patio. Not quite, not quite. Try it again. So nervous to go down that road because I don't have a way out. Can't just punch up. I really do not want to crash in the snow. Okay, let's come down. We're getting a little too high for FPV. Man, this shit is so fast. I'm so gonna crash into that fence. Let's see if I can orbit. Getting down to the minimal voltage here. I should probably bring her in. Gotta learn to fly slow and capable. There we go, she's down. Down, we didn't crash. Grab the last battery, we're gonna get some cinematic shots. I think. Okay, time for the last pack. See how this goes. So, recording yet? Yeah, still recording DVR. Hold down. Travel on. And punch. That was horrifying. Don't know what the fuck happened there. Pretty sure I nicked a tree. Oh my god, that was no good. Uh, that's why I went with analog instead of DJI, ladies and gentlemen. Fucking Christ. That was too much. Right now, 
God. Fucking floor is lava. Fuck this noise. Okay, so I hit one gap. Still fucking horrified. Don't trust my video to not give out again. No, let's not do that again. Let's just try one good split S. Okay, we're gonna go around. Come out of the 3D range. Split S. Bad. Okay, one less. Split S. So yeah, that's when you have to learn to split S and come through here. Oh my god, that was too much. Now we're again. Okay, we're, that's enough luck for today. We're coming back. fucking dying inside right now. <sighs> okay, well. Was it worth it? I would, yeah, I'd say. I feel like I'm gonna puke. My heart's probably going, I don't know how many beats per minute I'm well up there in the like the 120s and it's it's been a hot minute since I actually flew can't believe I hit some gaps I it's I don't even know how to describe it I was so nervous of crashing and like I want to just push harder and go faster and shit but like I don't have the conformal coating if I crash, that's it. It's like money. I can't put it down in the snow. But holy fuck. Totes. Totes worth it. Oh, and if you uh, look at that, the uh, electrical tape did its job because there's a hole right underneath there that is like pure circuitry. So, <laughs> pretty sure if I didn't put that tape there, I would have fucking killed the drone, but I'm, I think I'm okay. Have to uh, get more comfortable with this because goddamn, it's so touchy and different than the drone or in the, the simulator. I can't even think, I can't even talk right now. This is just, Holy fuck. So, FPV. Oh my god, that view. I need to start bringing the normal camera so I can show you there's the most insanely gorgeous sun rays over there. God rays even. Well, I mean, fucking FPV, that was amazing. I'm so glad. It was, it's never flown a fucking five inch. Fuck DJI, man. Your drones are 
pieces of shit. That's like, so DJI drone is like GPS mode and also what's, if I'm not mistaken, known as angled mode so that the drone can only tilt to so many degrees and then it stops. Can't do flips or rolls or anything fun like that. And DJI drones have, like the Mavic has a huge stopping distance takes like I don't know if you're going full speed with the DJI drone it's like trying to stop a train you're gonna have to be at least 50 meters of warning before you want to stop or else you're gonna hit a wall or hit a tree or something but my god this fucking drone is like driving a Ferrari compared to driving a train like you can just snap and fly. I didn't even go full throttle today. I was flying like a goddamn baby. The shit that I do in the sim is like way more aggressive, but I need to practice this real life video game a bit more before I get comfortable. And why does it have to be fucking winter in Canada and this floor being lava and all this bullshit? I just want to, you know, fly and not worry about crashing. Oh my god. Okay, so. Those flights were pretty incredible. First few packs, I was just so... Even the first pack, I was so goddamn nervous to even move or fly or go anywhere near anything definitely going to need to buy more packs so that I have a feeling it's going to be like every time you got to fly one or two packs just to get used to flying, get your confidence back but man, I need to also figure out what the hell was the issue with my video feed, I wasn't getting very much distance I'll have to look into that there's never nothing ever works perfectly when you have to build it yourself so we'll go consult Joshua Bardwell on the YouTubes and find out why my crossfire transmission range is only like not even a hundred meters because this thing's supposed to go kilometers but we'll see it's probably some shit of how I wired it up or the antennas on my fat shark or something I don't know that fucking that moment where my video absolutely cut out, that was, I was dying inside. I was up way too high in the air. I'm pretty sure I hit a tree when I didn't have any video feed. I'm gonna have to review the DVR and confirm that. But like, fucking recovering that was goddamn lucky. Oh my God. I just, I can't, I can't even fucking acro mode, man. I don't even know if I want to fly my DJI drone anymore. I might just, you know, give it to my sister or something. Maybe she'll buy it. Need to conformal coat the drone so I'm not so nervous. And need to practice more. Need to get more packs. Need to practice more. Need to not fly like such a pussy need to work on hovering. I need to even try doing a flip. Why didn't I do a flip today? I think I think I was nervous of the video feed. If I went up too high trying to do a flip, I would have no idea. I don't even like doing flips though in the, the sim. I guess I did a split S or two. Shout out to Mr. Steel for having such a fucking incredible build video and such an incredible drone. I can't even begin to expand, explain how thankful I am for that guy. And if you want to see some drone inspiration, go check out Mr. Steel on YouTube. Holy shit, the things that man does. Yeah. Well, I uh, feel like I don't have anything else to say. So, I mean, thanks for coming on this journey with me and have a good day. 
hate ending videos. It's so awkward. Bye.